Hey guys, time for another vlog hop. So you get to hear me talk like an Illinoisan. Um, and usually my husband does this with me, but he's not home, so he doesn't get to do it. So I'm just going to get to the words, and we're going to start with pillow, exhausted, governor. And this is actually a retake because I said governor really funky, and I didn't realize I did because I, I think I have a problem with my R, so I'm just not realizing this. But, um, <clears throat> entrepreneur, I feel so stupid because I can't say this word. I see it and I see how to pronounce it, but it's not coming out. <clears throat> entrepreneur, I'm going to skip it. I can't do it. Um, calm. I'm not calm right now, so. Milwaukee, Wisconsin, Bagel, Ambulance, Aqua, Femoral, Femoral, Femoral. I think that's like an artery or something, I don't know. Um, address, I actually say it two ways. If I'm talking to like y'all, I would say I'm going to address people. Or if I say, hey, write down your address so I can send you mail, but who does that anymore? Uh... Rural, I'm seeing that I have a problem with my R's now, which I've never had, so I don't know what's up with that. It's rural, R-U-R-A-L, rural, it sounds weird. Um, hypocrisy, and that's it for the words, but there's questions. So what do you call a store where you buy alcohol? Alcohol is bad news. I don't drink it. I have, but I don't, so I don't go to liquor stores. That's what I call them. I don't know if they have another name. What do you call it when you blow on a baby's tummy and make them laugh? That's blowing raspberries. What do you call batting your eyelashes on someone's cheek? Mm. I have a thing with personal space and nobody's eyelashes would be on my cheek. That's a little strange. I don't know what that is or who does that. Um, another way to say to deceive or swindle, that would be cheat. What is a funny way to say someone's not smart? That's not nice. I don't have any way other than to say that was stupid, but my husband says, um, not the brightest crayon in the box. I don't know. Don't say stuff like that. Um, another name for butt. That would be tush or tushy, but I think it's perfectly okay to say butt, and I don't know what people's problem with that word is. I mean, it's not like I'm saying ass. But, what do you call it when you drive through mud, lots of it, and don't get stuck or something, whatever. I don't know. Who I, who drives through mud? Who does that? Your car will get stuck, and then, what fun is that? I don't know. I, there may be a name. I've never heard of it. I've never done it. So, I think it's a little odd that you would intentionally drive through something you're going to get stuck in. But... Okay, I guess it's not. I, I'm not. I'm a little guilty here because I have driven through snow just to see if I could get through it, and I got stuck. It wasn't fun. So, I'm done. I've embarrassed myself enough for today, and I guess I'll go link up and check out other videos. Bye.